everybody, and welcome to day two of DirecTV South by Southwest Live. I'm Matt Pinfield. Now, Lauren Laverne will be back with us later on, but right now I'm joined here by the beautiful Sprint DJ and VJ, <laughs> Rachel Perry, right here on the world-famous 6th Street in Austin, Texas. Rachel, great to see you. You know, we both hosted VH1's Top 20 Countdown at different times, so we finally get to work together this weekend. I know, we've worked with the same people, but uh, we've never actually gotten to sit at the same desk, and I'm really happy to pinch hit for Lauren right now. And um, we're back for another eight hours of live music happening here at America's Biggest Festival. Yesterday, we had phenomenal performances from Daryl Hall, Augustana, Hanson, Martha Wainwright, and many others. And it looks like it's going to be just as rocking today. It does indeed, because we've got Dina Carter, Ryan Cabrera, Joanna Cotton, Hotly Tip Ting Tings, Daniel Lanois, and legendary LA punk band X, all live in our exclusive two venues, the Lone Star Lounge and the Bat Bar. I couldn't be more excited. I've been waiting my whole life to see X live. And it's the original lineup, and they're just great as ever. Oh, it's going to be great. And you know what? As well as the live music, we're going to have interviews from all of those artists and more, not to mention a roundup of some of the other fantastic events that are happening all over Austin in honor of this great music event. That's right. And right now, it's time to get the music started in here. Now, our first act is from England. He first performed at South by Southwest here in 2004, supporting his award-winning debut album, Boy in the Corner. We're talking about hip hop's own Dizzy Rascal. Yeah, and here to talk about him is E-Music's Yancey Strickler. Welcome. Thanks for having see me. You. And uh, you're a huge fan of Dizzy Rascal, so tell me, what is it about him that makes him so special? Well, I mean, the important thing to know about Dizzy is that he's very, very young. He's still only 23. Uh, his first record came out in 2003 when he was 19 years old, his first single when he was 16. And uh, he's really become a, a great new voice for music. Um, he writes these songs that are very sort of uh, emotionally naked. Uh, he's very, very um, sweet, but also there's a hard edge to him. Uh, he has a voice that you could shave with. I mean, he really has sort of this rough and tumble side to him that comes through, and he plays uh, music called grime, which is a form of UK hip hop that sounds like what the word says it is, um, and he's really been the leading force for that. So something like Boy in the Corner, his first record that you mentioned, Matt, uh, that won the Mercury Prize in the UK, and that's the prize for the, the biggest album of the year, the best album of the year. Uh, and since then, he's really sort of kept it going with stronger and stronger records. Um, his new one is called Mads in English, and uh, it's really it's an attempt to break through in the US, because in the UK, he's a pretty big name, but here in the US, he's Nobody. Uh, I mean, at a place like eMusic, where I work, or a place like Pitchfork, the music site, uh, he's a star, but for most people, they don't know who he is. So this record, he worked with uh, producers like UGK, who did Big Pimpin' for Jay-Z, they're from Houston, just big, big hip-hop guys. And so he's really trying to reach a broader audience. Um, so we'll see what happens. I mean, he's going to be playing the Pitchfork Music Festival this summer in Chicago, which will be a big, like, 20,000 people there to see him. So that'll be a big opportunity. And, you know, I, I hope he comes through. Like, he's, he's very strong. I'd love to see that. And you're here, too, working with a project as well. Tell us a bit about the thing you're doing with eMusic. Yeah, e well, I, I work, eMusic is, uh, is a download service, like iTunes. It's actually the second biggest one after iTunes. And um, we really sort of prize discovery, finding new artists, much like you do here at South by Southwest. And so we developed this program called eMusic Selects, where we find unsigned artists or undersigned artists that we love, and we give them a lot of exposure. That's so, great that you do yeah. that, Yancy. Yeah, Great sight and great to see you again. Thanks, Thanks for Thanks coming for by. Me. Yancey Strickler, everybody, from eMusic. Now, Dizzy Rascal will be kicking off today's live music right here after the break on DirecTV South by Southwest Live. So don't you go anywhere. <laughs> 